Okay, so I'm here with uh, Ian Robertson at Hutchin and Pierce in uh, Griffith in New South Wales, and we're having a look at um, well the most horsepower you can get your hands on in a tractor in Australia at the moment. Yeah, Ian. Yep, the John Deere the uh, 9RX830. So we'll run through a few of the basic specs on that if you sure. can. Thank basic you, specs, Ian. So we can see with this massive uh, bonnet and um, <laughs> air cleaning system here. Yes, Mark. Some of the basic specs are uh, the engine, new John Deere engine, 18 litre, which is you know pumping out the 830 horsepower. But under load, it'll push out 913. Yep, so under load, so over 900 horsepower, and it's a six-cylinder engine. That's a straight six. Yep. It's got a huge, big uh, hydraulic-driven fan, so it can be reversible. Yep. Um, huge, big final drives. Huge cooling system. I can lift the bonnet up. Yep. Pop the bonnet and have a look inside there. And pretty good access to all the cooling elements in there. Easy to clean. Um, oil cooler, fuel cooler. Yep. Um, and of course the engine engine water cooler. Yep. We did have a quick look at the fan, massive fan in there, which is reversible, hydraulic drive fan. Yep. No worries. Okay, moving along. Some of the, um, this one's fitted with 36 inch tracks, is that right? Yep, you can get 30 or 36. These are the heavy, heavy duty Camso 6500 tracks. They're yep. the, the heaviest in the industry that yep. we um, put on the deer. Um, this unit's on three meter centers yep. for controlled traffic. If you look around at the, the bottom idlers there, they're polyurethane, so they dissipate heat, they won't build up. Yep. Whereas some of our competitors don't have the polyurethane. But and it is a, a complete new track system for this complete, tractor. Yep. Complete build from uh, front to back. Yeah. Slightly bigger drive wheel. Bigger drive wheel, bigger, bigger wheels uh, throughout. Much larger wrap area. A nice wide lug for plenty of friction area to stop ripping lugs off. It gets the power down the ground without, it's going to give you some longevity. Okay, so we can see there's one of the, um, well, we'll call it a wheel weight, bit of track weight there, some ballast. Ballast. You can put ballast on the, on the on there. You can put ballast under the nose. It's all cast iron. Yep. We'll see some more ballast at the rear when we walk around the back. And that's getting up to, uh, we said, you know, gross sort of mass of around 38 tonnes, yes. Yeah? Base weight's around 32 tonne, so we've got about six tonne of ballast yep. on this machine. Okay, uh, cab again, all new. Cab's all new, got the new Gen 5 technology in there. Yep. Um, Slightly bigger cab from what the, the yeah, previous RX. Really larger, I think it's around 20% larger in space. No but a very nice uh, workstation. The seat swivels almost sideways. It's very friendly on your on your neck. And we did talk about the um, seats air conditioned and heated yeah. as well. Yeah. And has the massage feature if you option that. Massage later. feature. Yep. So it's a very nice cap. Okay, good access to the main air clean filter here. Yeah. You see. And no yeah. ad blue, so no ad blue, no John Deere put a lot of thought into the just the daily servicing of the machine with yep. checking your air cleaner, the fueling up, checking your water separator. Yep. It's all low, you don't have to get climbing up on things. A huge, can... huge big new transmission, 21, 21 speed with um, auto mode. As we said, top speed or road speed, about 40 kilometres an hour yeah. with the tracks. Okay. If you have a look at the uh, hydraulic pumps here, yeah. you can option it up to uh, triple pumps if you wish, which is pushing over 600 litres a minute. Nice. So it's a massive big, uh, massive, massive, massive big diff. Just a new drivetrain right through. Okay, we'll just pop around the back and have a quick look there at some of the hydraulics. Again, there's some more weight or ballasting options there. If those yep, weights sort of slide hips, on and off the rails there. On the rail there, so yep. it's all part of the build of this this unit, being the, the biggest of the horsepower range. Yep. Um, you've got your six 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 remotes. You've got your um, half inch and your three quarter. Yep. Uh, three quarter would probably be that high flow, then high pressure. It's a high flow if you're running a huge air seater double shoot yeah, twin fans. fans. You've yep. got a, a lot of flow to crank those fans up to yeah, where right. you need them. We did have a quick look at the hitch too as well. That's um, You can set that up to what the uh, customer wants, yeah? Yeah. It's a two inch pin. We, we've It's standard with a three inch. This is a, a John Deere conversion which goes back to two inch, which a lot of pins in the industry at the moment are two inch, but um, the owner of this unit can go back to three inch easily right. just by knocking the bottom bush out. Yeah, okay. 
All right, that's been a pretty good introduction. We'll hopefully be able to get in and see it out in the paddock one day. Sure. Thanks Thanks very much for your time, Ian. It's been good, good to see it.